My name is Lee, and this is my wife, Gabriella, and we are the Russies. Uh, we've been married since March 18th of the year 2000. Uh, that's uh, 16 years already. We have two boys. Our eldest is Judah, and our youngest is Ezra. And uh, the Lord saved us. And about eight years ago, not just a little bit more, uh, and we've been humbly serving here uh, locally in Cornerstone Baptist Church for the past five years, and I'm excited to do so. Well, we came to that conclusion at, uh, in a kind of a practical manner. Um, uh, the the people that come to mind in scriptures are people like uh, Priscilla and Aquila and Lydia who found themselves uh, in a specific area and perhaps um, found themselves with the opportunity to serve, uh, one in discipling Apollos, uh, the other one in opening her church or her house to, to have uh, the brothers and sisters come in and have service there. Uh, well. Practically speaking, there is a uh, pastor in our church, uh, Pastor Mark Mudge, who has uh, been called uh, to plant a church in Guatemala City. And both my wife and I, my wife being from Honduras and uh, me being of Hispanic descent, um, both of us speak Spanish. And we um, want to serve. Uh, we uh, have the means to do so and the and the desire to do so. So. And that really the question is why not, right? So, well, because in our church there is no pastor planting a church in Honduras, there is no pastor planting a church in Bolivia or Argentina or in a uh, a nice island country. You know, um, there is a path there happens to be a pastor in our church that is planting a church in guatemala city uh and uh, like we said before uh, because of that opportunity uh, because the, the lord works uh, providentially he is sovereign and works providentially um we feel that that is a place that we should go to what's been the most impactful or what's marked me the most about Guatemala City is that there are so many churches and yet there are very few churches. And what I mean by that is that uh, uh, the prosperity gospel, uh, uh, the false gospel of the prosperity gospel and uh, many other uh, schools of thought, such as uh, perhaps uh, getting into heaven by our, your own works, even though they may not say it that way, uh, but in speaking to people in Guatemala City, the majority of the people there, even being religious, going to evangelical churches, uh, the majority of them feel that they're right with the Lord because of their own works, because they've been a good person. Um, and we know that through the gospel, uh, that no one, no one gets into heaven by their good works. It's all by the mighty work of Jesus Christ on the cross and our faith and that and trust in that work and through repentance of our sins uh, that we can be right with the Lord. Uh, so we want to bring that message to Guatemala City uh, and helping our, our pastor to establish a biblical church there where uh, he can be and we can be faithful in preaching the word of God. Uh, to the city of Guatemala. The goal uh, really is uh, for me to find work in Guatemala City. Uh, so if anyone wants to contribute uh, monetarily, I would uh, want them to do so to our pastor uh, because I, uh, I hope to find work down there. Uh, but they could help with prayer, obviously, that I'd be able to do so. Uh, if you want to find out more information on the, the church plant, you could go to missionsgua.org and find out more information about the church plant and how you could donate uh, both to the Mudge, Mudge's family 
or to our family if we desire to do so.